Well, court case don't start again between, uh, of course, you know, Mubad Mata has started again, and that is a Mubad father and Mubad mom. They met each other at the court, and uh, of course, you see, somebody was trying to bring them together. And therefore, slap that man when they try to bring them together. <laughs> but <laughs> you saw how Mubad father ignored Mubad mom. If now you will call as a man, you know go ignore him. Hmm? You know go ignore her. If now you call as a man, won't you ignore her? They don't park property for mobile that's finished now. Nah, I don't clear. Now she called the, the, the Nidan, the great Moba Papa. The Nidan, the great The Nidan, the great If now you will call. They don't park the properties. Her heart don't clear now. Now, now she won't call the sick for justice for her son. Before, now this woman accused this man of several things. I don't know, I don't understand. Though. That is just to say exactly what thing they talk about this woman eh? entirely true. This is exposure. God now they expose them, say, this woman is there among the people, make their no one, make their sick for justice for Mubad. The only person actually seeking for justice for Mubad is only Mubad's father. Only Mubad's father. Who me now don't park property for house? Eh? And you know, waiting very dark man to talk about uh, Yabo Ojo being involved directly and indirectly. Well, I don't know about that. And I don't want to really uh, speak on that one yet. So I will allow VDM and... Uh, and uh, the Abu Ujo to fight that over. Like any purpose, anything. If I see my head, I get sorry. If I see my head, I get sorry. Anything. Mm. The woman said, whatever Mubaz dad says is final. We don't want any elaborate celebration over our son's remembrance. The best you can do is to pray for him. You all should please leave us alone and let us settle our family. <laughs> and Mama Mubad had the corona this morning. You are not serious. You are not serious. You know, they come on life, they come online, they come disturb Nigerians. Now nah, you see me, they leave you now alone. People, they donate money to you now uh, through TikTok. You are telling the same people, me, they leave you now alone. They know they leave you now alone. No? Since the family failed to to uh, seek for the real justice for Mubad, then don't expect anybody to leave you alone. They will drag you now like generator until the end of days. You understand? Because we're not getting a shit together. So nobody they leave now. Now, now even they even they say whatever Mubad father said. Hey, this woman, women there. Eh? Women. If I come on, if I, if I first uh, accuse uh, they are Naramali, Zina Naramali, and Zamnari by Mubad. <laughs> Later, he say he, uh, Mubad father, they try cover up. Now, wow. Women, uh, fear women. Fear women. Fear women. Well, let's talk about uh, Pop Daddy. This man over here. Sued Pop Daddy. This grown up man here who used to be a bodyguard to Pop Daddy. The man accused Pop Daddy that one day, while he was with Pop Daddy, they went partying. Pop Daddy put something in his drink and made him sleep off. So before he wake up now, he sees saying, Yes, don't tear. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so say pop that he do some certain things to her, make him don't remember. Now when he sleep, come wake up, come find and say blood, the dog this virgin. Man, grown up man. Now after so many years, is now requesting that court grant him a judgment to collect hundred million US dollars from Pop Daddy. 
Well, Puff Daddy lawyer has responded, say he no go see one single couple. Because all waiting they talk against Puff Daddy are extremely lies. So no single couple coming from uh, Puff Daddy. A grown-up man, I'm not saying nobody cannot be a victim. But there are some victims that you just will look like this. Ah, you too not victim. A grown-up huge man, while he was bodyguarding uh, Pop Daddy. Pop Daddy put something for a drink. Tear in ash overnight. <laughs> and you know complain for years. You know complain for how many years ago. Eh? Now, you now have the courage to call that your boss out. A grown-up man, a huge grown-up man. <laughs> well, guys, you know, <laughs> it's crazy. It is crazy. Guy, 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 it's crazy, guys. <laughs> Above that, it does seem why. The the only thing Pop Daddy is guilty of in my book and I guess Cassie is for my ass. That one I will say yes. I can say it's also guilty when it comes to McMill as well, but McMill is not suing Pop Daddy now. McMill enjoyed it very, 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 very well. Then I don't know about uh, Bonner Boy. Bonner Boy, you know, Bonner Boy on a rumor. So, Bona Boy never came out to say if not truth or not. <laughs> so, the only thing Pop Daddy is guilty of in my book is uh, not just for, uh, against uh, Cassie. That's all. The rest they are done. There is no proof, nothing, nothing yet to prove it. So, the guy is still working freely. Freely, the guy, they enjoy himself. Eh? So, a grown-up man, you that is supposed to bodyguard person, now you call the slip-off. Me person me suppose bodyguard call the tear your your yash. <laughs> make that make sense. Eh? Somebody make that make sense. Hmm? So you get some yeah, yeah, things and make court supposed to eh? go so I beg, please go and sit down. I don't understand why court go see proceed to listen to all those gibberish. A grown up man, it took you so many years for you to find courage. And you are a bodyguard. You suppose get courage to bodyguard people. Now you no can't get courage to come outside to talk as a den. Now now you got to come outside talk. Child. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's crazy though. It's crazy, honestly. Well, with that being said, let's talk about uh, Bonner Boy. You know, we we self even never know. How far between Bona Boy and Puff Daddy self? Up to today, we don't know again. Bona Boy is no longer hanging out with uh, Puff Daddy because Puff Daddy name is in the mud. Puff Daddy name is in the mud. Mm -hmm. It's stained. Really, really stained right now. So nobody wants to go get close to him. And you know, so that's why Bona Boy too just suffer a shift. But then again, Bona Boy keeps being the best. Because for Nigeria, nobody come close. That is the plain truth. So check out this new chart from uh, Spotify. They recently released the most followed artists, Afrobeat artists on Spotify. I never knew. Bonaboy was the first with five, 10 million. Wizkid with almost, let me say 6 million. Then David Doe with 5.5 uh, million. Then you see Remba, Asake, Arista, Kiss Daniel, Omale, Fireboy, Ruga. Check it out. Bona Boy used 10, 10 million. That means almost half. Take past the next top three. Almost half. Okay, check this one. Where Remba the thought say? No more big three and a big four. You guys are, you guys are talking. Just check it out. Rema one, uh, Bonner Boy one, Whiskey two, uh, David O three, Rema four. I mean, it's actually meant it. No more big three, but big four. Yeah, man, Bonner Boy is going on. Bonner Boy is gone, guys. Bonner Boy is gone.
is gone. Far gone. I don't know what these guys are doing. I don't know what the rest are doing. But Bonaboy is far, far gone. Well, that big up, guys. I thank you very much for watching your boy again. I'm Slink. Catch you next time. Peace.